Good morning and happy April. We have made it to April. Heading down to my favorite coffee shop. Gonna grab a coffee, have a meeting. April is going to be the month of wellness. This morning my meeting was with Hank Green and his team at Crash Course and we were chatting about their educational resources and they're wanting to make them better. But while we were talking, I kind of, you know, I, I look up to, to Hank and John Green immensely and admire their work and love their approach to creating and doing. And it kind of just hit me. Uh, apologies for the vlog getting more serious, but this is important to me. And I think you're gonna see a shift. Over, over the coming weeks or months. And that is wanting to, to create for, for myself and wanting to my art to reflect my, my feelings and, and my work and what I'm passionate about and not being afraid to just put that out there and not looking for that extrinsic reward or this idea of praise and whatnot and just doing it for the sake of doing it and doing it because I love doing it and love sharing and love building and love putting work out there. I just want to continue just to, to be, be my best self. You know, taking this in, it's, you know, as somebody who's 32, 33, you know, I'm a third of the way done on this journey and wanting to dedicate the rest of this journey to just being the best person that I can be and, and building and sharing and creating, being around great people, you know, and taking advantage of this incredible privilege that, that, uh, that I have to, to be born when I am where I did and, and wanting to, to pay that back as much as I possibly can. So enough of that seriousness, time to, time to get on with the rest of my day, uh, getting back to real things like emails and whatnot. But I, in the words of Hank and John Green, never forget to be awesome. Let's all work together to decrease world suck and save some of this for those that come after. Check out this view, oh my gosh. Yep. <laughs> So, microphone failed again. <laughs> Let me try that one more time. All right, so I think I fixed the microphone. Last day here in Kona. Gonna find a spot to fly the drone. I'm about six miles north of the airport at a state park away from the beach. The beach is about maybe a quarter mile behind me. There's nothing around me that I could possibly hurt. Just in case this thing crashes, didn't want to put anybody at risk. Wanted to give you a sense of these lava fields. As I've mentioned before, the island of Hawaii is the newest island. It's still growing and you see a combination of like new and old lava. This lava looks like it's a little bit older because it's brown. The grass is starting to grow up. You see trees that are maybe 10, 15 years old. I'm gonna go ahead and fly this around, give you a sense of the, the lava fields. Mission accomplished on the drone flight. Hopefully you got a better sense of the surroundings here. All right, it is 11.45. I need to go find a nice quiet place to get about four or five hours of work in. Question is, I would go to a Starbucks, but the problem is after you go to a Starbucks, you smell like Starbucks. And I won't have an opportunity to change clothes or get a shower until I'm back in LA tomorrow morning. So I'm gonna go for a local coffee shop at first. I need a Wi-Fi, need a place to plug in, 
need to be able to eat some lunch there. Just finished up an awesome work session in the Kona Coffee and Tea Company. Fantastic spot, had a great cup of pea berry bean coffee. Loved it. Getting in the car now, going to find a Starbucks to be able to charge. So this coffee shop was strategic in not having any outlets, like strategically, like cover them up and said, we don't have public outlets. So going over to a Starbucks, have a ton more work to do, but I was able to process the email. Now just have to start following up with folks. Going to charge the drone for one last drone flight as well before I head to the airport. Just wrapped up an epic session of email at the Starbucks. Man, does it feel good to get those knocked out and get caught up. I feel like email is like this ping pong battle where you're always hoping to catch up. You're never going to win. I recharged the drone battery. Going to find one last spot to give it a flight. I think I might drive down to where the Captain Cook hike was yesterday to show you just a little sense of the geography there. Let me show you the Kona airport. This is unlike any airport you've seen in America. So I've already gone through security. It looks like an outdoor lunch area that you'd find in a middle school in California. 